the Afters. Great to be with you guys tonight. We're going to play some new music. This first song we wrote with our friend Bart Miller. But tonight, I hope you'll all just be a part of our band. We're in this together. So would you help me keep the beat? Much fun. It's like a big family reunion. And it's so good seeing so many friends here. And we're playing all new songs tonight. And so we've never played these live, so hopefully we won't mess them up. I promise we're going to try our best. The good news is this no matter what, tonight we're going to sound the best in these songs that we ever have. So there is that. But uh, this next song is a, an anthem for trusting God and not living in anxiety and fear. It's called Fear No More. It's a heavy weight upon my chest As I lie awake and wonder what the future will hold Help me to remember that you're in control You're my courage when I worry in the dead of night You're my strength cause I'm not strong enough to win this fight you Thank you. 
song that we're releasing this week is called Well Done, and this song has been on my heart to write for years. I lost my dad about 14 years ago to cancer, and ever since then there's been this void in our family that nothing else has ever filled, and I have four kids now, and so I'm reminded about it every time we have birthdays, and every time we have family get-togethers, and it really hit home this year because I have two sisters that got married, and at one of my sister's weddings, I walked her down the aisle and gave her away. And my other sister's wedding, I officiated, my mom walked her down the aisle, but I couldn't stop thinking about how much my dad would have loved to be there and given his daughters away. But I remember looking around and seeing our family and realizing that we have a family that loves Jesus. And that's a testament to my dad who showed us what it looked like to live a life in pursuit of God. So the inheritance that he gave us was a love for Jesus. Me and all my siblings, we all love Jesus. There's not a legacy that he could leave that would be any better. And someday, we're all going to leave this world. We're going to leave the pains and the heartache behind. We're going to find ourselves in a place where we belong more than we've ever belonged before. We're going to go before Jesus. And on that day, I just think about how we're going to hear those words, Well done, my good and faithful servant. I finished writing this song on the day that Billy Graham died. I heard the news, and I, I couldn't figure out how to finish the song. I heard the news, and... I reached out to my friend Will Graham. He's become a good friend over the last few years because we do events together. And I, I told him that we were praying for his family and thinking about them. And he texted me back this quote from his granddad. He said, someday you're going to hear that Billy Graham has died. But don't believe it because I'm actually more alive than ever. And it just got my gears spinning. I started thinking about when we go to heaven, if it's overcrowded and there's traffic everywhere, we can blame Billy Graham because he told too many people about Jesus. But I also thought, man... That's the legacy of someone who can't shut up about Jesus, can't shut up about the gospel. And that's the kind of life I want to live. And that's what we're doing together. And so I'm just grateful to be a part of this community with you, grateful that we get to share Jesus together and partner in ministry. And I'm so thankful that we can build God's kingdom together. This song's called Well Done.
Until 